as Tolentino. This is a matchup I'd like to see. Armin Tolentino going up against Calvin Octana. And look at that. Wow. Armin Tolentino strikes first and gets the first two points of the game. Again, the second leading scorer showing no fear on that one. Very much willing to attack anybody's defense. Luis Galinato handing it off to Herbuela. Herbuela, free one extended jumper, doesn't go. Galinato gets the rebound. Octana driving inside again, dropping it off. BTR wow. puts it up and slaps it home. You see that? If he just dishes it off, it's easy offense. And then guess what? When the other team uh, hedges a little too much, he'll have his shots well. But a great way to start off the game. Zon sneaks it in under BGR. Wonderful dish off and the phenomenal throwdown slam a jam. But referee's letting it go, so the players must adjust. Adamos. Ooh, Galinato, strong move against the front line of Northport. Henry's so big, you should just call him Hank. I mean, that's, a, that's a big boy. As we see, Joshua Zon <laughs> shoot another lefty layup. Or he could be even Australian rules, I'm not sure. Alba posting up Kalinato. Shoots that floater. Nice looking move and from uh, Jen Kalma. Oh, almost a turnover. Rosales, risky pass. Gets it inside to Kalma. Who's against BGR. Take a look at Kalma. Whoa, spins! Gets uh, it a go over uh, BGR! Oh, ooh. Tolentino almost got it. BGR all the way. Oh, missing the gimme. Kumundin to Oftana. And TNT takes advantage. Uh, don't forget. RPTV na ang official and exclusive channel ng Pambansang Liga ng Bayan on free-to-air. Sabay-sabay nating sabay-bayan ang PBA Season 14, Philippine Cup. All games live dito sa RPTV para sa Pinoy. As Chris Rosales makes up for his turnover and gets a bucket there. Batang Beer going to work. Up by seven against a very, very good uh, TNT team. Yeah, this is a team that's three and one so far. Galinato, nice pocket pass from Calvin Octani. That. He was down seven from his 21 point average with just 14. Five out of 14 from the field against San Miguel. Also down one out of four from three point land. No legs under that shot. You know, they had, you know, Munzon with uh, Calinato out on that island right there. Yeah, see, here's the blur. Ivity coming out. <laughs> it's the adverb of blur. Gets a lead down to one. He needed an impact here for Castro. Tolentino, take a look at that, just missing. Zayn Lucero gets the putback plus the foul. Again, that's a sign of a really good team. And then you compound that with some really strong guys, some guys who are very tough. The stretch four has been a steady force off the bench for the Northport Batang Pierre, averaging around 10 points and more than four boards a game. Four games into the conference, and Zayn told me he's fitting into the team just fine, and he's just been trying to be a sponge. Nice what a pass, pass inside. Kobotin just couldn't handle it. That's tough. We can hit him a bad part of his hands. Bulamnadi, no hesitation. Pulls from the outside. <laughs> well, what a story. Give out it yeah. also a product of the PBA 3x3. Nice Correct. to see him thriving here in the 5 on 5 is Bulanadi. Five straight points for Ale Bulanadi. I'm telling you, Bulanadi, you cannot give him space. And now, guess what that does? That gives guys like, uh, you know, Lucero and uh, Calma. And uh, even Tolentino has some extra <laughs> space. As Northport now has a double-digit lead here late in the first quarter. As they lead this one 25-15 to 15 with 2.52 remaining. Goes for that shot. A little bit of a heat check for him. He already made two in a row, though. That's a green, green light for Bulanadi as Tolentino gets those three points back for the Tropagiga. That put lead by the bottom pier, already 28. Nice to see Ara Pahoy back in action here after tweaking his ankle early yes. in the game. Missing that floater though. Bulanadi gets it to Zamar. Zamar pulls up, shoots, and scores! Nice. Again, everyone that Coach Bonnie puts in is playing at a high level. The confidence that confidence, Coach Bonnie exactly. has put in his uh, team. Oozing. And you can see, even by the, the coach's stance, I mean, all three coaches standing up, encouraging players to, to do their thing. Uh-oh, here we go. Lucero gets it a go. Too easy for Zave Lucero. Oh, another turnover. Navarro gets it to Zamar. Inside, Flores drops it nice. off. Kama, beautiful ball movement. 
Probably the easiest look he's going to get all night. He missed it. Kalma gets it to you. Brand new. Nice pass inside to Kalma. You know, that, that is right there the definition of a team that if you're aggressive, good things will happen. And speaking of aggressive. Gets it to you. Brand new. Nice pocket pass to Adamos. Jumper falls yeah. for Ben Adamos. Yeah, that's a perfect setup. What a setup. Drive, draw, and dish, and Adamos delivers. Again, just great IQ by Fran Yu. Galinato posting up Adamos through traffic. Galinato muscling oh. his way through. Take a look at this one more time. Strong and, move by Galinato. And you know, some people would say, is that a possible offensive interference? By uh, BGR. BGR, because he grabbed the rim. So, Flores back to Tolentino. Oh, he gets Galinato up in the air, drives, kicks it out, Paraiso, a wide open three. That is good for Brent Paraiso. Tolentino pulls up, can't drain the three, battle for the rebound, look at that. Paraiso, Tolentino one more time, this time that falls for Tolentino. He has been splitting their uh, free throws here in the second quarter. Tolentino, heat check, Why not? goes in for Tolentino, plus the foul. And one. So again, when you're playing well, that rim looks bigger and bigger. It's like throwing a little pebble into the ocean. Wolfsburg just keeps increasing this lead. Oh, but he misses that last one, but Flores gets the ball back. Amores off the bench, makes a three. That's a six-point play for uh, Northport on that possession. Ouch. I mean, if I'm uh, wow. TNT, just absolutely ouch. That was a very painful time down court. Castro and throws the steal. ball away. Northport, everything going for them now. Behind the back, Flores gets caught in the air. Slows things down out to Munzon. Tolentino loads up, shoots a three. That's a three, Tolentino with 25. When it is your day, it's your day. I don't know what his career high is, but he's probably thinking about it right now. Our boy all the time the world and he swishes that one through. Seems to be falling for the drop on Giga. Rosales drops it off. Kama spins. Wow, what a move, Down Kama! There. Gentlemen, after a tough first half giving up more than 60 points to their opponents, I know Andre and Vince, you guys wanted to know how the atmosphere of the locker room was. And according to assistant coach Sandy Arespegochaga, there weren't many emotions. But and they got some good quality guys there on the bench that they haven't even used this. Itami, uh, and, uh, you know, Balotaha. Whoa, what a dribbling exhibition right there for Rosales. And Arvin Tolentino takes it away, shoots a three, misses the open three. Oftana's going to attack now, Munzon spins. Wow, just a strong move by Calvin of Tana, and that forces Coach Bonnie Tan on demand or in full game highlights. Download the app by Google Play or the App Store or watch by FilipinosLive.com. Register now for free as Jim Kalma going downhill once again gets another bucket for the Tropa Giga. You know, just doing the right things at the right time. I mean, that was a nice play right out of the timeout and a good job. Ooh, and a steal there by Ponzon. Let's not forget, Monzon leads the league so far in steals as Rosales kicks it out to Monzon. Finds himself in the three-point line, and he drains uh. a three. A broken play gets better for the bottom pair. Just not a good sign for TNT. When, you know, when he starts hitting those shots, it even makes the defense have to extend a little bit farther. It's just difficult. Dave trying to get that charge. Bogoy is on fire right now, drains another three-pointer. TNT, Oktana driving. Look at that, the hands of Joshua Munzon. Here we go. Showtime. And he lays it in. <laughs> Babo swings it. Pogoy, R has been on fire, and he gets another one. But there's going to be a foul. Kicks down, smart play by Zamar. Not a lot of time left here in the third quarter. Zamar inside. Okay, Flores uh, with a finish. That's tough. They played pretty good defense for about 22 seconds, and then right at the last minute, what a nice pass, and what a nice nifty left-handed shot. And this is the biggest lead of the game for uh, Northport. 31-point lead right now for the bottom pair. Aurin, again, not shy to shoot. Finally makes yeah. a three. 
turns the ball over in that first possession. Whoa. But Zamar turns the ball you know over. What? Someone's got to tell them. What a block there by Zane. What a, yeah, definitely. Two points saving block there, but maybe he should have gave up the two because <laughs> then they got a three right after that. Kimorin really going in hard. Again, you can't really say anything negative about Kimorin's production. He's just, you know, whatever you give him, he'll take it. Back to back threes by Kimorin. Think a little bit this. First and second quarters dominated by Northport 32 and 29. That's all he is. I mean, it's not like he's playing flashy or making, uh, you know, all the... Kumuntin now attacking. Kicks it out. Montalbo. Three seconds. Has to shoot. Three-pointer. It's good. There Big it shot there by Montalbo. Points in the paint. 24 TNT. 44 Northport. So they are getting inside. Him Aurin with another three. Oh, oh risky where? pass by Kelly. That was going nowhere. Navarro doesn't see it. Aurin on fire. Aurin with a three. It's a first things first, though. They got to get stopped. Simple basketball. Score and don't let the other team score. Saw and had a lane. Navarro is there for the putback. Remember, remember we were talking about not giving up any more layups. They cannot afford to give up those shots. Again, there's too many second chance opportunities here for the bottom. Yeah, they throw the DND drop on Kika. Give out in. Wants to go down low, Pavoy in double digits. Leading scorer for TNT adds to his point total. Wants 100% solid effort at all times from his team. And again, that's a good habit to teach, especially for a young team like this. Take a look at that. Teamwork by Northport. Can be more calm. <laughs> because Kalima. everything is taking care And right now, Jason Paso only has four in this game. Not a good game for uh, Jason Paso, but our Pavoy. Is doing his thing. I love the app by Google Pay or the App Store. Watch by FilipinasLive.com. Register now for free. Northport. Kalma shoots a jumper. Oh, swishes that one through. Take it for whatever, he, any direction it comes from. Just take it for now. Oh, Munzon drains a three Northport. on cue. Hey, Northport is definitely a team to be reckoned with. I think a lot of teams are watching this uh, game right now and saying, hey, anytime you're playing against Northport, do not relax. So, uh, some time. Aurin feeling it. He gets blitz. Bogoy from way downtown. Yes, sir! TNT wow. with a run now. He flies over the A board. Ooh. He's okay. They got numbers. Five versus four. Panfrana is still on the other side. Oh, Tolentino takes advantage and gets two points. That might be the Pamatay Sunog for uh, the Northport Bata Pier. You might be right, my friend, but again, let's see. Uh oh, Taha oh. takes a dip. Pogoy drops Taha and drains the three. Hey. Aurin almost to the steal. They flip it over to Taha. Taha shoots a three, airballs it. Ball ends up with Taha, gets tipped. Tolentino cleans it up and finishes for the Bata Pier. Boy, now being double team. Has to kick it out to Ponferrada. For this, Flores all over RR. For the defense of uh, Flores. RR. Yes, sir! 34 for R. Bagoy. 10 seconds on the shot clock. Under a minute remaining. Taha. Shoots a three. Ooh, swishes it through. That's a, that's a little statement shot to us. Like, hey, I can play this game. Give me a little playing time, coach. And that puts the lead back up to 18. Aurin, Woo! what a game he's had so Baller. far. 18 for Baller. Kim Aurin. And that was a nice hezzy in out dribble along the baseline. Great, strong finish at the rack with the left. Uh, again, not giving up the basketball. Goes all the way and sails in for the layup. And uh, the Talbo adding the finishing touches to the small game as Northport will probably hold this. But let's see, they can score this because, uh, of course, yeah. the margin matters here, the lead quotient system. Yeah. I don't think they're going to take that shot. Perhaps not. As Northport will head to their fourth straight win here in the Philippine Cup after dropping their first one.